I'm Marcus K. Delling, the Nashville Country Music Report at the Tennessean, and I'm here at the ACM Lifting Lives event here in uh, Collin, Texas during ACM uh, Awards Week, and I'm with someone who knows a lot about this event this year, Parker McCollum. How's it going, man? Man, I'm blessed. Glad to be here. Absolutely. So with an event like this, talk to me about the importance of doing things for Lifting Lives and working with an organization like this. Man, the, the biggest thing I think you can do, anything that's philanthropic, is donating your time. Uh, you know, writing a check is, is great and good in itself, but anytime you can donate your time and, and have so many good friends of mine who are on the bill tonight donate their time to come out and raise money for, uh, you know, an organization that does so, so much for uh, the country music community. I think they donated $4 million during covid um, to you know all kinds of people in the all aspects and levels of the music business and, and country music and um, I think another two million dollars since then I think that number's correct so um, you know we're looking to raise you know over half a million dollars tonight uh, to continue their efforts in that and so like I said writing a check is good but actually getting to be here and, and for them to ask me to host this thing and, and kind of be the face of it this year is a massive honor we don't take it for granted um, but again, you know, donating your time, I think, is, is worth just more, just as much as writing a check is. So we're glad. Absolutely. So I want to talk about confidence real fast. We had a conversation about Never Enough, and you said that Burn It Down was the single, like the big single off of it. And this is before the album came out. Mm -hmm. And now it's obviously doing the work. So talk to me about being at a point in your career where the, the confidence feels more empowered than usual. Uh, you know, I think you just get... Uh, just trial and error in any business in life you know country music's no different so you know you got to swing the bat to hit the ball and and you're gonna miss a few times i've missed probably more than anybody else so you know to have swung it and and feel like we hit a home run with burn it down was was pretty special it's my fourth number one in a row um and now i just man i kind of you know for this next album I've, I've got a whole new perspective on on what i'm you know, kind of capable of doing in country music and, and a little more confident to branch out and, and kind of try some new stuff, some new sounds, write some different songs. So, um, golly, I, I try to act like I know what I'm doing, but I feel like I still really don't. So we're winging it still. Absolutely. So final question in relation to community. You talked about having the guys here tonight that you, you know, typically are around in general. So talk to me about being able to do something like this and pull them all together, like and say, oh, hey, I'm doing a concert out at Top Golf. Swing through. Well, Co Wetzel's going to be here tonight. He's coming to sing. The love. ultimate swing through. He's guy. coming to sing love with me. He doesn't do anything like that. So um, the fact that he actually agreed to take time out of his week and and come out and do that well for me here at Top Golf is I couldn't believe it. I called him. I'm like, there's no way you're really coming, and, and he is. So um, that was pretty special. But man, to have Old Dominion and Warren and uh, Ashley Cook on this thing. Jordan Davis is going to come out. My band learned a couple of his songs we're going to do. So, man, it just means the world. And, and, it, and it makes it a lot easier on me, man, to get to have, you know, some other people come out and, and kind of, you know, get some different fan bases out, mix them all together and, and just have a good time, man. And like I said, it's all for a good cause, you know. Um, your time is not wasted being at this thing. You know, it's really going to something that makes a true difference. If you're in the music business, you have family in the music business, or anything, friends in the music business, you can see that direct impact that Lifting Lives makes. So to get to be a small part of it is pretty special. Absolutely. Well, this has been Marcus K. Dowling, the Nashville Country Music Report of Tennessee, and here at the 59th uh, Academy of Country Music Awards Week at uh, ACM Lifting Lives with Parker McCollum. Thanks a lot for your time. Thanks, Marcus. All right.